And welcome back to Good Morning San Diego. Check it out. Look at this off roading. People in San Diego County love their off roading Dave Stahl. And you've got an update for us on a situation going on with Ocotillo Wells, apparently. Yes, yes we do. It's, it's a little dire. We have to really get on top of it. And uh, Desiree Bates, good friend of uh, Ocotillo Wells and the off roading community, is going to kind of explain to us what's going on and, and why are all these folks here? Well, all these folks are here because we um, all love Ocotillo Wells, and there has been a recent lawsuit affecting Ocotillo Wells. Um, a private group called Peer and the DPC has filed a lawsuit against um, California State Parks, and um, currently the State Parks has issued or has issued a demurrer. So basically, um, these private groups are trying to tell State Parks how to run the state park and that is illegal to do so so mm -hmm. now we have until December to find out if the if the lawsuits even going to be dismissed mm -hmm. ah. but you have to bring awareness for one exactly and generate money for for the groups that are here in San Diego we've got uh, we've got San Diego off-road coalition Corva Tierra del Sol um, there's plenty of off-road groups that need assistance and you know what there's always something affecting Ocotillo Wells so so basically we're just trying to get out get the word out that no matter what we need you to get involved. It's, there's a group on Facebook called Fight for Ocotillo Wells. I moderate that. Um, and so if you don't even get involved in a group, at least go to fightforocotillowells.com and know what's going on in your off-road community. Mm -hmm. And Rob Nabell is president of District 38 Off-Road. You're one yeah. of the groups getting involved here. And, and why do you think it's so important to keep this area open to people who like to recreate this, there? This area, it's been used for I don't even know how long, maybe 80 plus years. Mm -hmm. We don't race out there, but we do support the whole desert. Mm -hmm. You know, we're not just about racing. We want to keep the deserts clean and keep them open, let people use them. Well, yes. Rob, you, you brought up a good segue. We've got my good buddy, Mark Stahl, who's no relation to me and he spells his name correctly. <laughs> Tell about the history of Ocotillo Wells. You were just mentioning it to us a few minutes ago. My dad started going out to Ocotillo Wells with my grandfather in the early 1940s. So my family has been going out there for, what is it, near uh, 70 years And your now. dad's, what, 87 and yeah, he still goes out? My dad's 87 years old, still goes out. He started taking us out. I take my kids out there. All of our families still go out there to recreate and have a good time. And we're all responsible off-roaders, and we need a place to off-road. And Ocotillo Wells is the closest. Right place that we have to send in San Diego County so and state and the state's been doing a pretty good job all these years right right yeah so I don't think we need to so what can people do in order to help you get your message across and help you with what you're trying to do here to save this for off-roaders currently just get involved either whether it's join a group and just stay informed um, like I said, Fight for Ocotillo Wells will constantly update you on information as to what's going on with this lawsuit, as well as um, groups that you can get involved with. Um, like I said, San Diego Off-Road Coalition, Tierra del Sol, Corva, they have all been, you know, huge in this lawsuit. So okay. just get involved. Yeah, absolutely. And you can see bikes. Oh, yeah. There's a lot of different uses hey, out got, there. We've got we, buggies out here. We've got one rider here that's yeah. has got to do a shout out. Uh, okay. Guys, tell me, don't touch my mic. Don't touch my mic. Did you see that guy touch? Bye, Mike. Go ahead, brother. So pretty much we're all out here to ride and just want to have a good time and why shut something down that where we're going to go next. Yeah, mm -hmm. Exactly. So. And that's what it's all about. And then, you know, just some of the words here. And let's talk to the ladies of the group because, I mean, you get drug out to the desert, right? Because love, you love it. I love it. I've been going out there since I was a kid. It's a great time. Families can actually connect to each other instead of looking at their iPads or their iPhones and learn all those great things that we need to do to have a great life. And find out what a schmore is and all these wonderful things. And they get to see the stars. That's right. right yeah, lots right. to see well, you Desi, out there. Again, mm -hmm. give the websites out again. Or one, that website. www.fightforocotillowells.com. All right. All right thanks deal. for coming in, all of you. Thanks, Dave, right. as hey, always. Give everybody get a KUSI right. wave. Uh -huh. Everybody say goodbye. <laughs> and I think December's the date, right? That's when they're December 13th. Yeah. Yeah. rolling. Right. So take action now. All right. We'll be right back with much more ahead. Good morning, San Diego. Don't go anywhere this is the place to be i got just one life in a world that keeps on pushing me around but i stand my ground and i won't